I just watched X-Men. And I was blown away conceptually all around. <laughs> Magnetic Gandalf, he's like, you know, like, he's got the right idea, but he's like not right. You know what I'm saying? Because like, okay, so like you got your mutation going on, okay? Like, and I've met a lot of people with some mutations going on, okay? And none of them are as awesome as in this movie. Oh, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so, like... <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, they're in Canada. Obviously. Right? Because, you know... Everything awesome starts in Canada. Okay? <laughs> and so... We're sitting there, and P.T. Barnum... He's shirtless. He's fighting a dude in a bar. In a Canadian bar. And he's headbutting. Just tink! 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 Because he's like... His insides... Are like, you know, uh, aluminum, you know, and uh, he's he's got the claws, but he's like pretending he doesn't. Like, P.T. Barnum wins the fight, okay, but then these guys are like, you don't have scratch on you, and they're like, go to like start shit with him, which is like the worst idea, because he just didn't lose, and didn't have a scratch on, so they're like, oh, he's invulnerable to things, and so they're like let's go over and start some shit with him and he's like i'm not having it and this other guy's like i'm gonna pull a gun on you and he's like didn't you just hear this whole conversation all right i'm totally fucking made of metal and i will chop you up oh man <laughs> okay and then like little academy award winner mutants watching him and like he's like she's like oh this guy seems like, you know, he's lied in a fight. He took money from Canadians and he chopped up a, a gun. This is somebody I totally want to hang out with. Okay. So I'm going to sneak on his, of, on his hovel and it, I start my life as we're just two mutant buddies hanging out. I mean, what's the right idea? It was, you know, like it ended up being the right choice, you know, in the end. P.T. Barnum crashes the car. Okay. And then... Who shows up? Catwoman. And and Superman's baby daddy is <laughs> in it. <laughs> from from you know, Superman with with the guy this the guy that played Superman from uh Nine Lives of Christmas. Oh my god, Nine Lives of Christmas is awesome. And he's trying to figure out just the right color of white to paint his house. And then like there's a cat and there's like firefighters and he's on a calendar. This is a thing, man. Like, if you don't watch Hallmark movies, you need to go watch Hallmark movies. That just makes sense in, in the grand scheme. Of like, you know, they never fully explain why they're like, this is the guy. Like, yeah, he's an ass, but, you know, this is the guy that you want to, you know, <laughs> prove your point that mutants are awesome. Like, you should pick an awesome guy and be like, see, and then give him awesome powers but instead, they take a senator and they, <laughs> they jellyfish him, okay? And like the worst mutant power ever, Professor freaky Picard, he's like, he like gets in this like egghead machine that Kelsey Grammer built. <laughs> and then he's like talking to everybody's brain at the same time, which... I can't even talk to two people at once. And he's just like, I'm going to talk to everybody at once. And everybody's like, no. So then it all ends up on the Statue of Liberty from France. Okay. And like Magnetic Gandalf is just kicking everybody's ass because of course he controls the everything. Okay. Like, you know, he's like Mr. Nimbus. Like, he controls the police because he controls guns. A climactic moment. <laughs> so, the God Academy Award winner, tied up to the Statue of Liberty. Why not, right? There's, you know, Gandalf has style. Okay. Or something. And then, like, Catwoman, like, can't, can't use lightning. Okay, but wind would have worked. <laughs> Blow him off of there, okay? Catwoman, get it together. Like, I don't care if you could control everybody's mind, right? 
because everybody's mind has nothing. You could drop a satellite on somebody. Okay? You drop a satellite on somebody, that's game over. Okay? Everybody's got something wrong with them. Okay? And a lot of people suck. But just because they suck doesn't mean that they shouldn't have the same rights as everybody else. Right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, man, I gotta go. Uh, call your mom. Love you.